Good morning. And welcome back to the channel. We're here at Pictona at Holly Hill. Pictona is right off of Route 1 in the Daytona Beach area. I never knew what Pictona meant. It actually is the mixture of pickleball and Daytona, but it's here in Holly Hill. So let's, let's play, play some pickleball. pickleball. I'm Laura. And I'm Rob. Together we enjoy traveling and playing pickleball. We review pickleball courts and we'll take you with us as we find fun and exciting places to visit and play in the U.S. and around the world. Here we are, this is uh, Pictona 1, and uh, this was the first part that was built, and this opened in July of 2020. And uh, we have uh, eight covered courts here, and these are really popular in the summertime and when it rains. And we have the paddle rack system over here where players put their paddles in and they can rotate four in, four out. Uh, we have 49 courts all together, or as we like to say, we have 48 courts and one championship court. <laughs> <laughs> Very nice. Well, these okay. courts here too look like there's some stands out here for, yeah. for spectators. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. These are, and, and during some, some of the bigger tournaments, we'll use all of these courts. Okay, yeah. yeah. All these now, courts. you guys hosted a PPA event. You also yep. hosted an MPL event. Yep. Um, yep. And APP. so all the APP as well? APP, That's... and we run um, uh, local tournaments, our, our own tournaments okay. that we have. And, and those can generate, you know, uh, we can get between 900 and 1,200 people. We also have the Diamond Amateur here, okay. uh, which is up to 1,400 people. It's an eight-day tournament. And uh, that's 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 a big one. This building here is the only building left over from the, you know, the original field. Okay. It was that was here. Yeah. But the city, it's a good partnership with the city because the city actually owns the facility. And so, what are um, just hours of operation on a on a daily? Um, uh, weekends basis? we go 7:30 to 7 p.m. Uh -huh. And weekdays we're 7:30 to 9. Now Friday is special because it's music night. <laughs> yes, we heard about music yeah, night. So we, yep. we, so we have a great speaker system and we crank the music throughout the whole campus and we're open till 10 o'clock. Ah, oh, yeah. wow, nice. Yeah, we have a restaurant over there called The Kitchen. Okay. Yes, and um, and a lot, of, a lot of beer flows on Friday night <laughs> for sure. Yeah, but the food is great over there. Love the Smashburger, Smashburger. Mm. A bathroom yes. for the men. Yep. And for the ladies. Yeah, over here, this is uh, uh, friends, friends of Pictona. Um, and these are people that have donated and companies that have donated uh, to Pictona. You know, Pictona is yeah. a nonprofit. Mm -hmm. Okay, so we, we rely on um, you know, donations too, as well as, okay. as our membership fees uh, to support us yeah. in, in tournaments too. Great. So, um, so, so there's a bunch of them here. And if you, you know, you put it, if you donate, you get a, your own little paddle up here. On uh -huh. the, on the uh, on the wall. So yeah, so you basically have things set up for a beginner, intermediate, advanced. Play, yeah, the it courts. Like. The, yeah, the courts. You'll see labels on the courts for and and um, for different levels, and you also have different times. Mm -hmm. You know, for instance, Sunday afternoon at 1 p.m. is advanced time, so certain courts are put aside for mm -hmm. advanced players. Mm -hmm. Okay, and and but you can pretty much find any level of play. On, on a day here. And you guys offer lessons here as well? Yep, so for, yep, uh, yeah, at we all have, levels? yeah, we have uh, five instructors on staff and okay. we're, we're gonna have some more. And um, yeah, you have lessons or classes and, and we have an instructional calendar that comes out every month. Yeah, what would, a, what would a beginner need to know if they were gonna come out to Pictona? Well, we have something called PB 101, which okay. is a free class. You can take it as many times as you want and that'll teach you the basics of, of pickleball. Mm -hmm. And we run that uh, five days a week. And you know, sometimes in the afternoon, sometimes at night, and they're full. Okay, they are full. And mm -hmm. then when those players, uh, they be, you know how quickly you become addicted to pickleball. Absolutely. Okay, <laughs> yeah, they become addicted. And then we have some other intermediate classes. I teach something called a next steps class, mm -hmm. which is um, you know straight out of PB 101, and then we just kind of reinforce what they okay. 
what they've learned, and then they, they, they come and they get addicted and they play. They play a little bit more. Yeah. So what would a beginner need to bring? Just Would they have to bring their own paddle? Do you guys have paddles uh, Beginners, uh, PB101, we supply everything. Yeah, we supply paddles um, and, and balls and, yeah. and, 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 and the fun. Tona 1, we have the, the covered courts. We have six courts over here, all lighted, 10 courts, 10 lighted courts over here. Okay, and pavilion. And as soon as we leave <laughs> this area, we're going to be going into Pictona. Two. Okay. Largest. So, yep. Over <laughs> Pictona two uh, opened. Uh, we had a grand opening in um, November of 2022. We've had a lot of generous uh, sponsors here. Uh, this is the Metro Health Stadium, and you see they have the Humana Education Center. Mm -hmm. We had uh, Metro Health donate. Uh, these tables, for instance, where m players can can sit and rest yeah. and uh, have a drink. Uh, over here, this here's a, a restaurant number two. It's the Depot More Concession Stand form. Oh, nice! And during tournaments, we open that, and they serve grilled food and you know hot food and refreshments and sandwiches and things like so that. So just uh, during like tournaments. So yeah, special events, special. tournaments. Yeah, the kitchens open all the time. Okay. You know to serve to serve the members. We have 20 more outdoor courts here. Okay, and it kind of spreads in an L fashion. So we can head in, inside okay. uh, under the cover here. So, uh, matter of fact, last Thursday we had a, um, a we call it the No Hunger Summer mm -hmm. um, fun, uh, fundraiser, and people, had this, uh, six cans of food was their entry fee. Mm -hmm. We raised $1,500 and like eight truckloads of food. Wow. It was, it was just amazing. That's impressive. Yeah, we did the same thing at. Uh, uh, Christmas time as well, and we're doing Toys for Tots later this year. Gosh, that sounds so great. Yeah, it's really nice. Yeah, not only part part of the mm -hmm. community, owned by the community, but again, giving back right. to the community. Yeah, it's very true. And we have, uh, these are instructional courts that we use. Mm -hmm. Okay, and members can play on them as well, but you know, this is the, more of the education area. Mm -hmm. Okay, and courts over there as well for, uh, for instruction. This is our yeah. championship court. <laughs> wow. Okay, and we let members play on this. Okay, for sure. Very so you may nice. play on it today. Oh, that would be fantastic. Yeah. Oh my gosh. Can I fill up the stands and have people cheering for me? You can. We can. <laughs> yes, just start texting your friends and, <laughs> and get, them all, get them all over here. When the Major League Pickleball is here or the PPA, while the pros are playing here, this place is filled. We can fit a couple thousand people in here. Here are um, skyboxes, okay, or suites. And, uh, and we're going to go up there and take a look, but, you know, um, People can can rent those out and and look and look and, down at the wow. at the, the championship court uh, for the games and it's it's really really fun. Well, um, you want to head up into the building? Yeah, that would be All great. Right, wonderful. Mm -hmm. uh, so in here, um, so we have offices in here as well as the sky boxes. And uh, here you see uh, Reiner Martin's uh, suite. He's away right now, and his wife Julie. Um, they're both away, but they're the ones. This was their vision. This was their vision, and they put up a lot of the funds to, um, you know, to uh, to build this place. Mm -hmm. And uh, you know, the, the, no detail was spared. They really. Yeah made a great place and yeah. uh yeah you said pictona 2 was open opened in 2022 2022 when did, when did pictona uh, one? july of 20. okay july of 20 and then realized that well we had space and yeah needed some more needed some more courts and yeah because tournaments we have tournament special events over here and the membership can still play yeah. on the other side mm -hmm. and uh we have uh eight suites this is the dove suite they're all named after birds and here Come on in here and check this out. Yeah. So we were talking about uh, ages, how you're seeing younger players. Oh, oh, in droves. Yeah. Um, for instance, last year, we, we run a summer camp here. We run a summer camp. And last year between, I think we did three camps last year. I think between all of them, we had maybe 20 children do it yeah. for this year uh, we've been in four camps and we're having uh, over a hundred wow. uh, yeah so that in was one a, year That's in amazing. one year just a huge huge jump and you yeah. see it during a lot more families playing with kids uh, we have some schools that come here uh, mm -hmm. we have a, the home school program they come here and play pickleball every Friday mm -hmm. and I have to tell you 
whew, some of these kids can play. Yeah. You know, yeah. really, really good players. Yeah. I've got a, I've got a shout out to Lincoln. <laughs> I'm thinking of you right now. We played with him in North Carolina, mm -hmm. and he's a young player yep. who has a lot of promise, and yeah. he's, he uh. has his own channel too. Oh, <laughs> okay. All right, Lincoln. The link below. Yeah. And real nice kid, nice oh, nice family that we met. And yeah. And it's just fun to watch. He'll come out, and he doesn't have all of the baggage of either other sports or injuries <laughs> right and right can be so um creative yeah with their shot making it's just really cool to see well that. uh lincoln we expect you to be out here <laughs> playing a championship game at the uh, mlp in a few years Absolutely. okay um so paul is there any are there any clubs or anything that go on here organized uh, events or clubs that oh yeah we have a we have a whole bunch we have something called a, a pop program okay. okay and we have a lot of um stru structured round robins and mixers and different events you know where players of similar levels get together and they 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 play matches and keep score there are standings a uh, team pickleball is something that we're really starting to get into okay. we have a tournament coming up in um in mid-august called the sundown showdown it's a saturday night event mm -hmm. uh, which is kind of rare but it's a saturday night event but yes and it's you have a team team play team pickleball you get a team you come in and you you battle it out, and um, you know, similar to the Major League Pickleball. So, we, okay. yeah, so we got we got a lot of different, a uh, lot of lot of different events uh, uh, that are being run now, and that are going to be coming in the future. So probably now it's a good time to introduce our gracious host here, Paul Lambers, who is the associate director of education at Pictona. Perfect. Mm -hmm. Thank you. And Paul, thank you so much for having us out here today. What a wonderful tour you provided. Oh, it's, it's, really it's, it's been it. really great giving giving you both a tour of Pictona, and we I think we're going to see you here again. Yeah. At I, hope, some I don't point. think you, you won't see us here on Center Court. Yeah, yeah, <laughs> yeah. But uh, but hopefully uh, in the outskirts, playing with all the wonderful people. Yeah, here yeah. I'm sure. You, yeah. Well, we have we have 1,300 members here. Wow. Okay, 1,300 members, and we have a lot of people that come as guests. We have daily passes available, and um, and come spend spend the day here, and uh, you can play pickleball. Then maybe during the day head to the beach, which is a mile away, and get some rest, and then come back at night. And your day pass is still good. You can you can play yeah. at at night, and get in, you get in more pickleball than you could ever imagine. <laughs> well, and again, we'd love to have you back and, and play a lot of pickleball here. So. Yeah. Thank, okay. you so Thank you so much. Yeah. Uh -huh. So from Pictona at Holly Hill, I'm Rob. I'm Laura. And I'm Paul. Keep, keep traveling, traveling and keep, keep playing. playing. Perfect. That's right. <laughs> <laughs>